Hi, I'm Stephanie and this is my home, the 16th century Chateau de Lalande. Lalande was owned for hundreds of years by a family of marquises who were at the heart of French royal life. One of them even had the honour of being sent by King Louis XV to greet Marie Antoinette on her arrival in France. But, far from being a stuffy museum, this chateau is a living home. I live here all the time and I'm regularly joined by my mother, my family, my friends and wonderful volunteers from all over the world who help me to lovingly restore this historic home. Welcome to La Lande, a chateau filled with life, love and laughter. Philippe has woken up filled with energy and enthusiasm, I think all because of the tray in New yeah. Cocktail Corner. Yeah. And you want to upholster the, the chair, that yeah. was, the, the, the sofa. Okay, we had a sofa, and I can show you through the window, there's the sofa. It was at the top of the stairs, um, and it was here when we bought the chateau, oh. and quite stained, so we have to upholster it. And Philippe wants to re-upholster it. Which I love, and we found a really nice fabric. Want to show them? Yeah, shall we? Okay, is that still in there? Yeah. All right, let's go. We redid this entire cabinet, all because of the purchase of that tray. But then when we were sitting in here, we realised that this room needs much more work, and things spiralled. As you can see, we've been looking at a lot of fabrics. Right. We want to replace all of this mess here with a beautiful sofa so that we can sit opposite each other in the evening, chatting near the kitchen with and a with a cocktail and not disturb Marie when she's cooking or anyone else when they're cooking. So this is the fabric we found mm -hmm. and I was quite inspired by my trip to La Mirande. This was a little bit too bright, so we're going to use the reverse. I really like it, it looks so good in here. I think so too, with the pineapple as well, with, with the lamp. Yes, See, we have a bit of a pineapple theme going on in here now. It's going to look fantastic. But first you're going to paint. Yeah, I'm going to sand it first and paint it like like on the chair there. Mm -hmm. but like the gold's been rubbed off of it. So yes. You can see the red showing through. So it's a brownie red Yeah. covered in gold and that is how the chair is going to be repainted. Let's go look at the chair. Let's go. Yeah. Project is about to begin. See, it really, really did need doing it. It was like that when we bought it, actually. We haven't made it worse. So you have the red paint. We need to find you some brown paint. Right. And then you're sanding. Look who's coming to keep an eye on what you're doing. Wow. You've got quite an audience yeah. now. Cat's another one. <laughs> Has the tray gone too far? <laughs> One two year old tray has it perhaps maybe spiraled slightly. It has spiraled, <laughs> but I'm now hoping that the tray has created such a wave of creativity in the house that we might just end up restoring the entire chateau by the end of the weekend. Just yeah. Just keep going. Yeah, we've got another what, eight hours left on the day. Yeah. yeah. I think that gives us about time to, to do one get chateau. Up to the attic. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Okay, so we've got our work cut out. Uh, obviously, I decided to focus on my hair first. Yeah, that's the most important. You can't be creative without good hair. This is the before. I'm getting a bit of stick in the house. I don't know why, <laughs> but I am. What's that look, Maggie? What look? <laughs> You're looking at me like, really? <laughs> I have to leave this in half now before washing my hair. But cuts. what is it? It's an elasticizer. Is hair supposed to be more elastic? Very, very much so. Clearly, I need elastic hair. I'm going to look for brown paint. Okay. Look, I was still in bed when Philippe got the urge to start on it. <laughs> How's it going? We're looking for a brown. Like a dull brown. Okay. Yes, and we found an eggshell brown. Count your blessings, name them one by one. It will surprise you what the Lord has done. Is it working, Hanny? Ah, oh, yes, I love roosters. <laughs> <laughs> Hanny's complaining about the rooster, and Hanny and I are both complaining about the work that we're having to do, and Mummy doesn't like whinging. <laughs> so we're counting the blessings. Yeah, that's her way of fixing it. <laughs> 
Oh, you feel better, don't you? Oh, mummy, yeah. I definitely I feel better. Definitely do. <laughs> <laughs> Success. <laughs> right, back to work with renewed energy. <laughs> so this is one of the shutters that you finished. Yeah, this is uh, one of the shutters of the bathroom yet to be renovated. The loo. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> the most exciting renovation project we've had in a long time. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope you're going to come back and see the finished loo. Absolutely, I'd love to. Good, because this is very sad. Davy's leaving today. Indeed, I am. I have to, to get back to work. Yeah, that is really annoying that there's that. Absolutely. <laughs> but you've done a beautiful job here. And even more than that, I'm very, very excited to put a lot of your plans into action that in the be, garden. That would be exciting to see indeed. Yeah, okay. So we'll see you very soon. Yeah, I hope so too. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye. By the time you come back, there'll be an amazing pergola making the um, vegetable garden perfectly symmet symmetrical. That would be wonderful. Where is that? Where is that? <laughs> after is the loo. Back? Definitely after the loo. <laughs> I don't like people leaving. Bye. 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 We lost. <laughs> See you soon. Baby. No one ever bleeps, do they? Sad. I it's know. You always do. Oh, she did it! <laughs> this has just do, arrived. Do, do, do. I've been waiting for so long, and I can't believe. The By so long, she ordered it two days ago. Yeah, oh, it's been oh. a really long two days. <laughs> right. What do you want to realize? <laughs> This is quite pricey. Yeah. So I put no, it, I do realise it's pricey. No, I put it into the actual like purchasing um what do you call it? The basket. I put it into the basket back in like December. Oh, and about oh. every month since then I've been putting it into the basket and again, no, don't be ridiculous, you can't justify that. <laughs> <laughs> it's happened once a month since then. Yay. And I finally saw yeah. what was in my basket. Yay. All that was for the that. Dyson air wrap. Oh. All of that's in oh, there. Oh, I see. Natty, just think what our hair's going to be like for the parties. <laughs> yes. And also, everyone has been complaining about my hair. <laughs> what? How is that possible? I'm about how bad my hair is. But because I'm trying to grow out my natural colour a little bit more and just have highlights, I'm going through an awkward phase and I'm going to distract. <laughs> Uh, from that by adding curls and then people might not notice. Yeah. <laughs> the curl effect is... What about the tiaras oh. and... Uh, yes, and then hide with tiaras yeah. and headscarves. Of course, has a beautiful this leather. What is this? Oh my god. Whoa. Beautiful. <laughs> it's not to take on your travels. <laughs> no, I was sort of thinking it would be great for vlogging, but there's no way this is... You've got to feel the weight of that. Oh, that in hand luggage. <laughs> and maybe you choose only one and you take it to travel. Perhaps, with you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Whoa. So beautiful. How many boxes are there? Everything <laughs> with instructions now I compare with your mummy's with toaster. The toaster. <laughs> it's simpler than the toaster. Take <laughs> that off. Right, there it is. I don't know how long it's going to take. I've never used one before, but Michael Petherick is the person who told me I had to get this. Gwendolyn mm -hmm. has it. How nice. Oh, and we do love Gwendolyn's hair. We do. Yes. If you just look at the beginning oh, of the Petherick's, she does have magnificent hair, and we all want hair like that. So, yeah. um, well, there's just lots of sections. It looks so techy. Right. It looks too techy. Like, come on, we are capable of working this out. That's a professional got this. thing. I have no idea what to do with any of these things. That's a hairdryer part. Oh, I think oh. I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what you're going to use as well? That's a microphone. Yeah. You are, aren't you? Microphone. <laughs> that was 100% my first one. Bonnie Tyler on a miss. <laughs> what? Oh! Well, wow, wow, wow. wow. Mm. And I'm going to try this this afternoon, obviously. I'm about to style my hair with the new Dyson hair styler. But first I'm going to go downstairs, make myself a cup of tea so I have everything I need. And I'll show you what's happening downstairs because it's really quite adorable. Everyone's working on their own project. Try to do the Arga Saga part two. The Arga Saga part two. Well, uh, 
Literally, look, we we haven't even got all of the parts out of the basement. Yeah. In the, this is an exclusive, by the way. And this is <laughs> it. Thank you we very much. We haven't even got all the parts out of the basement, and it's the video is already twenty five minutes long. You'll have to do it in two parts. I've got another bit where I talk about all the parts I need to order. That's another thirty minute video in itself. Oh, I didn't think they're going to be bored. We're we'll talking about this saga for two episodes. How can they be bored of you and Ryan? <laughs> what a team. There you go, there's an exclusive for you. Oh, I get an exclusive. Oh, here behind we go. The scenes, behind the scenes, editing a video. Where is, <laughs> where's Ryan? Uh, uh, there we go, look. I'm going to find some gloves. And yeah. Continue. Okay. Right. Yeah, oh, hi there. Hi, Ryan. Oh, hi, Ryan. I'm Ryan. No, you're not Ryan. I'm Ryan. Oh, wow, really? Are you Ryan? <laughs> yeah, I'm Ryan. I'm just testing my microphone. <laughs> Got my gloves. <laughs> Is that what you do every time, Ryan? I didn't even know. That's not you were being filmed. Were recording me. <laughs> I was just, I was just told to test a microphone and say something, and it's the first thing that came to mind was just have a chat with myself. <laughs> so that's what I did. Well, there you go. This is what's happening in the dining room, which is today the editing suite at La Lande. Yeah. And here, Philippe is painting everything gold until we get the right brown paint for the sofa. Oh, it's so good to see more and more gold going onto right. the chateau. I love it so much. It's quite patchy still, but it needs a second coat. And then yeah, fine. yeah. I look fantastic. Mm. Let's see what's happening what's happening in the kitchen. <laughs> dusty, oh. dusty camera lens. You're doing a little bit of dusting at the same time. Ah, <laughs> uh, Natty is organizing the office. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Making some uh, space for the letters. Yes, because we have to clear this whole area. Now we'll see what's happening in the kitchen. I'm pretty sure a lot. Last time I walked in there, it was a hive of activity. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Marie is making a floristry video. Look at that. Oh, Marie is gorgeous. So behind the scenes of Marie's floristry video. That's right. <laughs> taking a little break to see um, the process so you can get lost in what you're doing and maybe you can overdo yes. the creative process so it's nice to take a step back, take some photos and then re-evaluate uh, what you're doing. Lovely, yeah. yeah it's good to see how you do it. So now there's just whites and greens so yes. what I call the foundation okay. bouquet and then I'll go past, um, I'll go afterwards with some beautiful <gasps> focal flowers. Oh, they're gorgeous. Yeah? Gorgeous. So something is good, but these beautiful snapdragons are from the garden. Yes! Yeah. Finally, our cut... wonderful new cut flower area is delivering. I know, and this wild carrot, the fennel is from the garden, the dahlia. <gasps> oh, they've come out, the dahlias have come out. Look at this. This and that was one of them? Yes. Oh, it's gorgeous. I know. It's wow. So, lots of goodies. And we got beautiful hydrangea. Oh, they're spectacular. Which we should have in the garden. I was going to say, I wish they were from the garden. We must plant them. Maybe. Your mother said she wanted them. Yes, yes, yes. Me too. And there's more creativity going on over here. Because cat. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> cat is attacking the carrots. Carrot cake. I love carrot cake. So do I. I'm not a baker. <laughs> <laughs> just just saying I this. A caveat. Don't like following rules or instructions. <laughs> it's quite important in baking. It's not in cooking. You can put this, put that. But in baking, apparently that makes some quite important structural changes. <laughs> so I'm going to try and follow a recipe. Okay, but... good luck. And when do we find out whether it worked or not? <laughs> I don't know. We'll find out. <laughs> in an hour and a half? I suppose so. I don't know. We'll have it after dinner. Yeah. Um, yeah, these carrots are a bit um, limp. On the term. It's a limp carrot. Yeah. Could that be a thing in there? Why do you Carrot fingers. <laughs> Michael, <laughs> go and edit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready to try my new styling device. You have to have your hair 80% dry, apparently, which I think it pretty much is, maybe a bit drier than that. I'd be leaving it to dry naturally. 
Otherwise there is a hair, hair dryer attachment, but I won't be needing that. This is quite literally the first time I'm using this. So it could be a complete disaster. There's so many attachments, but I've decided for my first attempt, I'm just going to do big waves. That's the plan anyway. Mummy, are you ready for this? Mm -hmm. Because I yes. have an audience. Well, yeah. I'd say an audience. She's a bit more interested in her iPad at the moment. I'm but... writing to someone. <laughs> I think oh, he yeah. of little, little um, arrows have to point toilet. away from my face, pointing towards my face. I think it needs to go that way. Uh, I know, I need things to section my hair. Oh, I'm faffing. There we go. Don't even know how to section my hair. Luckily, Michael Pethrick has insisted I have these in the past, so they were in my bathroom. Then we take a little piece of hair. This is a section. I'm going in. Oh! It holds itself! Whoa! I'm wrap that bit round because it didn't hold that bit. I'll bring it back out and do it. <laughs> it's like magic! Right. Are you ready for this, Mummy? Mm -hmm. It wouldn't be a very dramatic curl because I'm using the big barrel here just to try today. Well, I have a curl. I can't believe it. Well, I'm going to carry on. That was supposed to be on this side of my head, but I'm supposed to have the arrows pointing away from my head. Never mind, we'll carry on. As I've started off the wrong way, I may as well carry on the wrong way. Still can't get that bottom bit to wrap around. Right, I'll come back to you when I've done a little bit more. Otherwise, it could be a very long video for you all. I'm not convinced that my hair was quite dry enough. But actually, I put this elasticizer in my hair this morning and I maybe didn't rinse it out properly because it feels quite heavy with product, which is not the fault of the air out, that's me. Um, but I'm just going to try the top with slightly smaller curls to see if that works. But I have to say, I have found it really easy so far. It took me about four or five to get used to the way that it wraps, but that seems to be fine now. So I'm way more used to the way of getting it on now. It's working much, much better. And the great thing is, I know this is a really weird thing to get excited about, but I have a free hand for a cup of tea. Usually when I curl my hair, it takes both hands. Now I can just have tea, write to people, look at my phone. Ooh. That was a fun bit. It's time for the very last one. That's all my hair done. And as you can see, when I switched to the smaller barrel, the curls got really tight, which actually I prefer. And the larger barrel that I did at the beginning is more for getting really just loose undulations in your hair and volume. Now that I've done this, I sort of feel like going back through the others and making them a little bit, a little bit tighter. I'm actually really pleased with this for a first attempt. I'm going to leave it. I won't brush it yet so that I can give the curls time to set. I went over some of the first ones with a slightly smaller um, barrel so that it would be a bit tighter. And so far, I'm really happy. We'll see how it looks later. We'll see how everyone else is getting on. Mm -hmm. Something's missing. Yeah. That's yeah. what she thinks. She thinks it looks too clean and tidy. And it needs something. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's so beautiful. It's breathtaking. Oh, they look good. That's a carrot cake. That looks beautiful. Um, but I did what I always do, which is I started by being very strict to the recipe, gram by gram, and then as I went on, I couldn't find any um, 
brown sugar, so that's substituted. And then um, I decided some it'd be good with orange juice, so I did a bit of orange juice. But they look okay. They look lovely. So, um, and I will be the first to tell you how they taste. Yeah. I um, await your judgment, Your Majesty. Oh. Hello. Yeah. Did you like it? Yeah, I did. Does any everyone get a hair style? Oh, of course. It's in my room. Anyone who wants to use it, go for it. Excellent. How are you doing? This then? looks spectacular. Oh, thanks. Not finished. I think it looks too clean now. Too tidy. Right, so yes. what are you going to do? I don't know. Why didn't you just ask everyone to act normal? No, and then no, within five no. minutes, there'll be no, a ton of chaos. mobile phones. It'll be utter chaos. Oh. <laughs> it won't be tidy at all. <laughs> Did poor Ryan over edit? Morning. <laughs> is it editing exhaustion? It is. You just want to be near where the carrot cake's happening, don't you? It smells delicious. I know, it's I like so it. good. Yeah. You're looking very glamorous. Thank you very much. I had a new hairstyling device. Wow. I mean, you look lovely before. You're wrong, but... Carry on. Well, you're too <laughs> You've been up to exciting things, haven't you? Let's go and have a look. Okay, let's go. So it's only half painted. Okay. I realised that if I'm going to do like the red over it, it might cover it up completely. Yes. And I want to check if um, I do the gold on this directly. Okay, so let's have a look and see how it looks. Great. Okay, wow, it's so shocking to see it with brown on it. Whoa. Yeah. And also you can see uh, like the original colour is like bright yellow. Like, you can see it bit on here. Uh, here. Oh my goodness, it yeah, it's faded so well. much. Like on the back of your hair, you can see how much it's faded actually. Wow. Well, I like the original colour a yeah. lot. But that was just a bit too bland, right? Mm. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So it's just gonna be like on my finger and then rub it in. Yeah. In a good spot maybe here. That's fun. That's working really well. Yeah. Should I like that. And then just leave the little bits yeah. of brown showing through. Should I just do that and just finish it in brown and then skip the red? I think so. I think so. And that too. looks good. Great. We might have to order more of that. Yeah. Okay, I'm on it. Great. Marie, every time I come in, it's more beautiful. Thank you. I'm currently disturbing Kat's uh, <laughs> dinner preps. Okay, so Kat, this is what we want the dresser to look like all the time. Yeah, it definitely will. <laughs> I can't see a problem with this ever. No, it will always look like that with the you know, full baguette. Yeah. Well, Mummy, what are you going to have as a snack? Well, I shall have this paste there. Yes, this is the sardine paste that we were sent last week from Portugal. Ooh. I'll try it on this and then I'll try it on proper bread so to get the unaltered taste. Good idea. You have to try it both mm. ways. Mm. A couple of gifts have arrived for Dan. So yeah. he's very kindly agreed to join us. My first ever appearance. Yeah, probably not your privileged. last. Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> so tell me, what is your best dish to cook? Yeah, yes. We're back on this subject, are we? Mummy mm -hmm. <laughs> keeps coming back to this mm. subject. I was head chef and manager at a fine dining restaurant just outside a Goodwood race course. Um, I worked alongside the Navy in Portsmouth in like the officer's mess, so like the yes. higher up yes. you know, sort of thing. So there is usually pretty good food in the officer's mess. Well, that one particularly, because in Portsmouth, um, it's like going back in time. It's like, it's a whole gated community and it's only like the admirals and the captains that are allowed in there. But like the dining hall was like, it had these massive murals, like the size of that whole side of that building, hand painted of ship battles, Battle of Trafalgar. Wow. And it was just so dramatic, you know, yeah. like big vaulted ceiling and the ceiling was... Um, the ship victory it serious? was the underside of the no. ship turned upside down and they had big 15 foot walnut tables and it was just some completely something else like so they needed dramatic food to go with the yeah. surroundings we had all the time like um princess anne used to come like every month and it was quite a really well-to-do 
yeah. you know, sort of thing. So well, I think, you know, if you think for them, I think, think for us. <laughs> I, I was going to say, I think he's well trained for La Lande, personally. Yeah. 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 Now and then, when we have a few admirals of the fleet. Yes. No, I don't mind doing a one off, maybe. We'll see. Ooh, okay, you heard we'll it see. here first. Mm. Also, like back in the day when you were first trying to impress Annalise, what did you cook for her? Well, I can't really say it on camera because she's very simple taste, so probably if I wanted to impress her, it'd have been like chicken nuggets and chips or something. <laughs> That'll probably impress most of the people in this house. Yes. <laughs> yeah. If anyone would like to see the latest episode of Caddo at the Chateau, it's over on the new Chateau Unwrapped channel now. I'll put a link to it here. Hello, everybody. Hello. 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 Kat, this is wonderful. Well, nothing done. Mm. Oh, thanks, Stephanie. It's wonderful and I love it. Mm. Oh, <laughs> I love you. <laughs> and you lot all look lovely and I love you all too. Oh, <laughs> what's made you so um, lovey? Food. That's uh, <laughs> <laughs> usually what does it. Brenda has just given Michael and Ryan. Look oh, flag caps, yes! Wow. There you go. Brenda, Thank you Brenda very much, delivers. Brenda. Brenda <laughs> it's like Christmas. Brenda, I wish you were on camera, but Brenda Gibbons is here. She's off camera. Look, Selma has one too. Wow. Oh, yeah, and you go for the backwards look, Selma. Oh, what, Selma was tickling the back of my neck. It's the. <laughs> <laughs> you have to take it out. Carry on living in hope, Michael. <laughs> the men of Lalande. Right, I'm going to bring it over here first. Oh, and cake. Guys. The cake of oh, Lalande. The French, <laughs> they don't like cream cheese because it's not proper cheese, so they don't sell it. Oh, that's true. So the alternative was creme fraiche because it's also a bit tangy, um, but it's not got the same structure and texture. Mascarpone is the answer. Cheese has. You're right, it would have been, but that's <laughs> not what I've got. Anyway, so... <laughs> I'm going to look at it. I'm looking at it, Kat. Step aside. The top oh, cake keeps lovely. slipping off. It just, <laughs> it's amazing that it made it all the way here. <laughs> well, here is the new Steve. Hello, Steve. Good evening, everyone. <laughs> Steve has come for a couple of weeks to help me edit Caddo at the Chateau. Yep. Thank I'm you so help. much. This is your first day. It is my first day. And already you're turning your nose up at Cat's cake. I am not. <laughs> it looks spectacular. <laughs> Dave! Nope. <laughs> I think it looks amazing. He's made a powerful out of him. <laughs> oh, what dancing. I don't think he wants to leave, Cat. <laughs> Look at him. He's on limb. I need to just check that I've got my radio mic receivers because if I haven't, um, problems will arrive. arrive. You'll be back again. I'll be back again, yes. Michael, before you go, yeah. somebody has sent this wonderful coffee for you and you didn't get it last time. Chocolate cappuccino. I know, right? Not even coffee. <laughs> oh, you're taking a lovely thing. Your tin. And what's this? More gifts? You've been yes. a very naughty rabbit. <laughs> you're a rabbit. Is that oh. like a tea? Yes. Read the caption. Where's the caption? A tea inspired by a very naughty rabbit. That's the most gorgeous that tin. That is gorgeous. What's the tea? A little bookmark. Oh, it's poor. Is it poor tea? Yeah. They're just gorgeous. Oh, I love it. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> are they dancing in the kitchen, Ryan? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they are, yeah. <laughs> the They're dancing because we're leaving. That's it. The celebrations celebration. are broken out That's in the it. kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Seriously, Kat, how is it possible that they spend all their time packing? I would offer to help, but I just don't want to. <laughs> are you going... Do you feel that? Oh, that sense of... Oh, ah. I feel like we've done this before. Yeah, that, there is a sense of deja vu. Deja vu. Must be in a past life. Must yes. be. Yeah. Because surely they're not constantly leaving us. Mm, Why are they always they leaving? <laughs> First, thank you so much for having us again, Stephanie. As always, Ryan, oh, it's God, a pleasure. Thank her. She didn't know you were coming. <laughs> well... I know, but... Yeah, to be fair, I had no choice. Yeah, exactly, but... <laughs> I, I mean, was very calmly sitting, eating my dessert. You took it well, so that's the main <laughs> thing. for tolerating us. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, is it finally done, Ryan? It's done. And the boot actually closes. Yep. Are you sure you don't want to stay? I'd love to stay, but duty calls. 
That's a beautiful thing. <laughs> that is a beautiful thing. I've got nothing to say. Yeah. You've not got any tunes in. <laughs> it's been glorious. Thank you for your invaluable help with the co cocktail corner. Oh, you're welcome. It's the least I can do. <laughs> Stephanie Jarvis. I'll find another corner for next time. <sighs> I can't wait. We're Bye, up. Danny. Bye. We don't have to go, though, Stephanie. Oh, just stop. Stop. Go. <laughs> I'm sick of saying goodbye. <laughs> Bye. Goodbye, sir. Goodbye again. A bientôt. Goodbye. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Sooner than you think. <laughs> yeah, well, that, that was absolutely true last time. Yeah. Last chance. How long last has it chance been to now, stop Pat? us. I've this done is everything it. I can. <laughs> okay, cat's coming out with a knife. Next? The knife to tie as well. <laughs> <laughs> They've left me no option. <laughs> <laughs> this is it. We're going. Ah, oh, the, the windscreen steamed. <laughs> I can't go anywhere. It's <laughs> too steamy. I've been standing here what? for 45 minutes. <laughs> Where are we going? We're going. Uh, we're going. All right. I can't get this is it. 3 a.m. <laughs> Goodbye. Bye. 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 See you soon. Bye. Two to one. Finally. What do we do now? I thought we were going to be standing in the courtyard all night. <laughs> I feel a bit lost. What? what oh, I could be. What we, do we do? I think we should, well, express ourselves through only one medium. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so this is how sad you are at them leaving. That's what you're expressing now. Absolutely devastated. <laughs> A huge thank you to all of our patrons at La Lande who are making this vlog possible. Especially our Dauphin and Dauphine of La Lande. Yedeland, Ether, Alice, Allen, Anna, Brandon and John Michael, Daniela, Dan, Banda, Lauren Barnes, Vince Barone, Denise Behrens, Linda C. Bradley, Candice and Ed Borkowski, Veronica Castillo, Zoe Dork, Sakura Dennis, Jackie Ellison, Nicholas W. Fairfax, Tracy Ferrari, Elle Fine, Caroline Furster, Brenda Gibbons, Abigail Grant, Brenda Harris, Delaine Holbrook, Kim Hasselhoff, David and Tong Henderson, Jacqueline Holmes, Helen Jacobs, Jimmy Kemp, David and Summer La Lande, Victoria. Victoria Lapine, Janet Hoff Lombard, Frank Martin, Kim Matlock, Meredith, Nina Messick, Robert Miller, Kathy Norrie, JC Award, MP, Maureen Palmer, Tamara Price, Tonya Renee, Yvonne and Peter Richards, RJB, Bettina Rojek, Hanny Ross, Elizabeth Scanlan, Sven Schreiber, Lisa Schultz, Jennifer Shanks, Patty Suhu, Susan Stevens, Jenny Stevenson, Sarah Thornton, Colleen Troyer, Jessica Walker, Brandy Walton, Laura Watkins, Greg Wood, David Young, and Lodovico Zordinazzo. And thank you to all of you.